Hello and welcome. Today we will be conducting a lab that teaches students that we can learn what water undergoes as it travels through the water cycle. The name of the lab is Water Journey. The materials needed for this lab are whiteboards, dry erase markers, and a water cycle picture with arrows. The Sunshine State Standards included in this lab help students by having them create a model to explain the parts of the water cycle. Water can be a gas, a liquid, or a solid and can go back and forth from one state to another. The inquiry question for this lab is, here is a picture of an ecosystem. Create a 10 sentence story that traces the life of a water molecule over the course of a year. The conclusion statement is, water on Earth is part of an endless cycle. However, the paths it forms vary from ice movement, water flow, and water vapor. Now onto the lab. Group students into teams of three, ask them to identify the different places water can go as it travels around Earth. Tell the students that they have a drop of water that longs to travel. It wants to see new places and experience the different phases that water can take. They need to state where the water drop starts and list the possible paths it can follow. Identify what the phase changes are as well. Now call upon groups to then present the journey of the water drop to the class. Some possible questions to ask include, where did your water drop start in the cycle? What are the phase changes and where did they happen? Write a travel journal for your drops trip. This concludes today's lab. Thank you for joining us and we'll see you next time.